diamond level Protoss? Uh, that I think that may have been around the time before the nerf. I mean, before the the ladder the ladder ranking change. So, I mean, it says that he is a platinum Protoss on the League of Chicago highest. roster. Yeah, and it says highest achieved is platinum. Okay. And Wolf Brother is a gold player. So. Okay. Awesome. And I believe he's the gentleman who does the two base bio stem one one timing. Ready. I feel like that time when we get shut down by one Colossus. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It's true. But we'll see. Maybe he changed up a little bit. Um, Ezri, he in the sh show matches with Silvar, even though that was a PvP, he did mix up his play. He had a bunch of different PvP builds that he did. Um, he, I think he went Phoenixes every game, though, if I'm not mistaken. I tried to look for that VOD to get more familiar with his play and remind myself, but it disappeared. Mm. Yeah. Um, I think you don't see many Phoenixes in the Terran vs. Protoss matchup. Um, and sometimes at the high level, you see them as, uh, you know... Damage soakers for those Vikings if they're just kind of a move into the air. Yeah, I don't see much. Oh, I mean, I see Phoenix play all the time because I'm a Zerg, but that's left to be said. But um, will Ezri use the Stargate in these games as the playful Protoss in the bottom left hand position? Going up against the top left position, Red Terran Wolf Brother. And Whirlwind, um, now out of the out of the ladder pool, uh, no longer able to be used. No Whirlwind anymore? No Whirlwind. Oh, it's been replaced with that Stronghold, the very large purple map that's unbelievably huge. Awesome. The Whirlwind has been in like the last three la seasons, right? Mm -hmm. and this is like the map that just doesn't die. It, that and it, uh, what do you call it? It's been used in tournaments for a long time before that. Because I remember when I was uh, practicing for my show match against Silvare, this map wasn't in the ladder pool yet, but it was used by uh, GSL for, I don't know, quite a while when we looked at it. Very strong. Very, very uh, well-balanced map then. Mm -hmm. um, barracks first. Skin play coming out. Barracks first. Gateway first. No one, no one wants to go that greedy, greedy... Uh, expand first. Early Assimilator coming down, or early-ish Assimilator coming down for the Protoss. Meanwhile, our Terran opting not to take a, any of them. I mean, this, so this we definitely probably are going to see a uh, Marine in an expand. Mm -hmm. this, is definitely, this is definitely going to be a, 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 a Stargate or some, some sort of early, early harass tech. Or do you think he's just going to get his... We will see based on what this probe does, I suppose. <laughs> and it's doing the scout. Yeah, it's just going to scout. And it is scouting... In the right direction, while Wolf Brother, it's going to scout in the wrong direction. But once this probe gets here, he might be able to determine that he's in that position. No, because Protoss scout at all different times. Sometimes Protoss scout after that first pylon, so... You really don't know. Uh, when this proto when the scout comes in, where he's at, um, unless you see like where it came from the ramp. So if he if he noticed how it came from the bottom part of that ramp right there, I mean it still doesn't even, it still just means that he knows he scouted bot he's he came from the bottom, not necessarily that he was there. And um, Edgery did not get the scout on that uh, command center. I mean he can probably think of it, but think that that's happening for the marine being there, but he did not see it. Yeah. So this early gas was just to get that early uh, mothership core out probably stop any kind of shenanigans that the Terran might go for. I love the noise that the Mothership Core makes. When it comes out? It makes or like, when you just click on it? It makes, this like, it makes that baritone. Yeah, that noise that you just made. I love that noise! But this is game three. Uh, both these players are one game on each other. Or I, just, even. I just don't get like the holographic thing. Like the ring around it, like this holographic, like what does that do? I don't know. Is that, is that part of the propulsion system? No, it's not like, how is it even being propelled? I don't even know. 
it's being levitated by the holographic translucent blue thing. It reminds me of the puzzle box from Hellraiser a little bit, even though it's not a box, but the way it moves and looks, sort of. Hey, it's got a lot of moving parts. And the maintenance crew on that thing, oh my god, they must be called up all the time. Like, look how erratically it's moving and, like, a lot of fast jerks. Like, that thing has to be greased up probably daily. Yeah, and it's so hot because the plasma, and they can't just turn the plasma core off. No, yeah. We have a pipeline coming down at the third. And with the mothership core. Probably gonna do a little stalker zealot harass. Mm, he hasn't moved out of stalker. Stalker's just standing on the ramp. He's actually just coming in with the mothership core. Gotta pull those marines back. Yep, and that's a that's playing marines. It will scare this mothership core out. So the three barracks play coming from our Terran. Good micro getting that one wounded marine back so it wouldn't die. See you later, Mothership core. Oh, we do have a proxy Stargate coming down in this third location of Wolf Brother. Huh, that is a way late proxy Stargate, which might actually work out. Yes. And... Yes, that's a, this is a very interesting build coming out, because he also, he's also going the Robotech, so he took all the tech paths. Well, he didn't get a Twilight Cancel, but... He went both uh, Robo and Stargate, probably trying to get this Oracle Harass coming in. Um, and yeah, no, I'd like to see an NG Bay come down. Usually you want your two NG Bays started at least right now for the Terran. He's got the minerals for it. He's not spending it on anything else. He should really, there's one. Get the second one. Opting for just one NG Bay currently. Oracle being chrome boosted out, and that thing with this new patch has a like a four max speed and like some insane acceleration. I haven't seen it start flying. Oh, but he's gonna scout it! Oh, he sees he's it. He's gonna scout it. He knows that Oracle is coming. And there's Marines by the main right now. Oh, wow, and it's really you know. fast. Oh, the Oracle's skating around. Oh, but he's gonna run into oh. it. And he used, he used the charge, so he has to get out of there. He, he is not uh, killing anything today. This is really set uh, Ezri behind do, going this tech path and trying to get some harass out and not getting any harass at all done. No workers killed. Yeah, meanwhile, Stim and Combat Shield coming up. And we do yeah, and he's going, he's going every path at once. He's got the Twilight Cancel coming down. And here's the scans. You can see the Twilight Cancel and the Robotics Bay. So he'll have no clue what's coming because <laughs> there's <laughs> all this stuff. No, he and, has and taking a third. But the Oracle is actually just kind of chilling out here, and he hasn't put down uh, turrets, so the Oracle can come back in, and uh, you know it has to build up a little bit more energy, so it actually has staying power. Only Marines out so far. No, no Marauders. Just pure Marine. Wolf Brother loves his mass Marine. And here comes Oracle actually coming back in. I'll have to see the reaction time here. Oracle is charged. One, two, two three workers. Three. Four, oh, he's not reacting at all. Six, seven. This Oracle's gonna run out of energy before he reacts. He's pulling back. He's gotta run. He's gotta run his SUVs. Well, now he doesn't have to because because it ran out of energy. But but nine SCV kills. It basically paid for itself. Even though you want to have that happen earlier to um, inhibit the the economic growth of the of your opponent. However, it's still good to take out. Nine I at mean, this point in the and, game. And right now, Wolf's he's got these a lot of Marines, so we'll see if he gets this this one stim, you know, timing down. But there's a Colossus out. <laughs> There'll be a second Colossus out. <laughs> that that's enough. Gonna shut this down. Both brother not deviating from his usual build, and Edry doing the appropriate response to uh, Mass Marine. So after these two men of X. He still hasn't put turrets down. You really want to put those turrets down? Oh, my, that's a lot of workers in that natural. They should be uh, transferred. Oh, here comes the turrets. So finally putting down turrets. Do not have to deal with that oracle in the future. The oracle is repositioning. It's gonna come in first. Huge marine ball coming out, but our Protoss knows. He sees it coming. And he's he's got his third comfortably. He's getting his third going. He's got the double forge now upgrading 1-1. One, one. He's got the second Colossus out. He's chilling up on the high ground. 
Twilight cancels out, but I don't think he researched anything from it. No, he has not, but he'll probably get charged. There are seven workers on that one gas in the natural. <laughs> so, oh, what a everyone football. wants into that gas geyser, <laughs> let me tell you. Very exclusive. And the Terran Force moving toward the ramp of the natural. Yes, we'll see this. Tries to charge up here. Oh, God. Oh, he's, no. no he's Gotta get back. He's Ezra is get ready. Back. Oh, oh and it, it's. Time warp going down right on top. Two time warps on top of each other. They do not stack, so that was kind of a wasted second time warp. He is out of it. But no, you can't move in against those Colossus. I don't know if he knows the third. He could, he could easily take out the third right now. And he's still making he's still making medevacs. And the Oracle comes in is probably. Oh my god, look at that, look at that mule do a dance. Do you see the mule do the dance? Yeah, the I'm seeing that. Dance with mule. Yeah. No. Crazy mule. It's like, I wanna give you 30 minerals, please let me. And that Oracle's just doing whatever it's doing. Getting a few worker kills, a few marine kills. Die. Um yeah, I, I don't know. Wolf Brother, 30 World 1 workers on his natural. I don't know if this Oracle pressure has got to him or or the fact that he hasn't won is leaving him not knowing what to do, but I mean, he still has that third orbital. They're finally going to come move it over. Um, and he needs Vikings. He did this uh, in the previous games too. He needs to get his workers back on the gas in his, in his main. He's got to get his fourth gas, and he needs those Vikings. Um. We saw that against his, his other opponent, I think he played SMGGA Tech last week? Yes, he did. Where he, he went, Medivac's Marines trickled in the Marauders as he's doing now. Actually, he's getting a good amount of Marauders now. But he, he opts for not to get those Medivacs, and up to four Colossus. And Storm coming down right now. It, it's going to be oh. too late for him, I feel. Do you see these probes uh, in the main of Ezri that are... Oh, he's killing us uh, uh, again. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah, players getting uh, units trapped. Six probes got trapped back there. I'd like to see uh, Wolf Brother check out the third, or check the third locations. Check both of them. He, can, he comes, checks one. He should check the other, and he could probably mm, maybe take it out now. There's too much. There's those Colossus. Are just gonna do work against these Marines mm -hmm, without Vikings. One, the Protoss army is one one. Protoss just sitting back, sitting back. He's getting that storm. He's double Robo facility. He's got way too. He cannot. He can't support all this. I'll tell you that. But uh, oh, he's got that hidden fourth location going up in the top right. That seems completely unnecessary. <laughs> he could probably easily just take in a fourth in any of the two fourth locations and held it. Stim coming into the third though. Trying to get kind of delayed on these cannons, but go in. No! Do it! No! He's going for pylons. Finally going to target down the Nexus. He could get it. He will get the Nexus. And he will get the Nexus, but he has to get out right now. He needs to get out. Oh, he's got the clock a minute. He's going to fight this. Oh. Zell's going down, but well, this is the back are so strong. And reinforcements coming up the side. But the reinforcements coming. You know what? He did take out the rest of the army. Only the Colossus remains. And he does have enough Marauders, but now he just loaded up. Is he going to go into the main? And both are sitting at a thousand minerals, so... Uh, which just means he's not using his warp gates, because he's got enough to spend those... There we go, now those minerals going down, but we... The Terran... Yeah, he's putting down more barracks. Two... Only two is started. He doesn't have the other two plus started. He needs to get that done. I don't know if he didn't have the gas at the time or what. Here comes the Protoss force. It's going to move across the map. And it's going to force an engagement. Only one Viking. He's now just started Vikings. Oh, that's a lot of uh, a lot of dead workers. And now Bio coming up the side of the ramp. Getting force field it out. Force field is actually kind of working in his favor until he needs to run now, though. So he's going to fight it out, but those Colossus on the high ground. Um, he's killing the meat! If he could get through these last couple units, he can't get to those Colossus, and the Colossus will go down fast to Stim, Marauder, and Marine uh, when they can get in. Viking production finally started. Yeah, if you look at that, like, n n uh, that Ninja Force, like how much money has went into protecting it with those little cannons. And it didn't even need it. Or doing anything with it. So I think, oh, uh, he's going for the gas though now.
But he's got plenty. He should be pumping out more. He kind of laxing in this production mac macro right now. Getting back up his third, but he should be pumping out two more Colossus. Or at least using these warp gates. Here comes the Colossus. But, uh... 2-2 two, two nope. Protoss first, 2-1. These SCVs? Because he might just pull every SCV. And he could kill. Well, that's now up to five Colossus. SCVs is chilling in the middle. No, he just wants him to start mining from the third location. Even though he could still be my oil mule out the mule out is natural right now, and his main is almost out. Well, he doesn't have many. It was weird. He doesn't have many SCVs on his main. Yeah, he never really transferred many. He like pulled them all when the Oracle came. Ooh, and Edgeri does a pylon block. That's pretty funny. That pylon's not gonna last for long though. And I don't really like this push from this Protoss. He doesn't, no, he doesn't have, have enough. He doesn't have enough to take care of this. And now he sees it. And with all those Marauders in front to eat up that damage. You can stem forward right now. Oh, but the four Archons. Oh, no. No, thank you. Oh, and Ezri just eats up that bio. And and I think this is now the GG push. Mothership Corky in that position there, but four Archons. Storm oh, the beautiful Archons storm. To their death. Archons finally getting taken care of, but... There's the and Ezri taking that series, us popping into game three, but we'll watch the other two games to see what science. Just FYI. I mean, how do you say it? Our wolf brother. He he he's building the Vikings after he sees the Colossus count, but he scanned it. He should know, or he should. Either try to scan or try to scout more to see if the Colossus are there. If he's worried about making them prematurely. But usually, the, when you see that robo, especially when you see the support bay, they're gonna get the Colossus. They didn't put it down for nothing. So you really want, you really want those Vikings. And I feel like he just got them out, uh, got them out late. Mm, I feel like with all of our Terran players, they always uh, seem to do that. They don't make Vikings or adapt into that higher tech switch from, or higher higher tech implementation by Protoss. I mean, you want four medevacs, and then start your Viking production and don't stop. Unless you have scouted that it is not cloth. Um. But yeah, they, they keep on the just the MMM, and it, it, it's just not strong enough.